Hey guys, I go by the name of Illuminous Eyes. I'm here to illuminate the motherfucking wise. Okay, let me get a really quick message. This one's going to be a sex love message. It's going to be for Virgo. One card, please, off the top, please, for Virgo. I can use all of you guys' likes, comments, subscribes. Tell a friend and tell a friend about me. You heard me. Okay, can I get one card, please, for Virgo at the top for their love life? <laughs> I heard someone is not with the shit. Okay, Virgo, I heard you on that shit right now and someone is not with it, okay? Especially if this is a fire sign, they ain't with that shit today. Stop playing. Okay, yeah, temperance is definitely a Sagittarius. Someone wants you to slow down. <laughs> okay, four of swords. I feel like someone wants you to slow down or you could be waking someone up um, to, to sex. Okay, I feel like you're like kissing on someone or playing with someone's like um, private parts. <laughs> Moving on, I feel like someone is like literally scooting up or trying to spoon you, okay? Can you tell me why the temperance is here? I feel like, um, I feel like also the chemistry between you and an air sign is kind of off. I literally just started hearing that song. We're not making love no more. I feel like I feel like you and a Sagittarius or you and an air sign are going to stop talking or you guys are going to break up in four days. I'm also getting I'm also getting it's irritating to you that someone doesn't want to give you head. I'm also getting that you don't like you don't like that the the, the temperance I, I feel like you don't like the temperance drinking or you don't want someone drinking or someone could be getting intoxicated and falling asleep before the action even starts this is how intoxicated someone is can I get a card please for the temperance why is the temperance here I feel like there is some chemistry between you and someone else, but there's not a lot of communication. Okay, so that's a lackluster on the relationship. Okay, definitely with a fire sign. Okay, I'm getting I'm also getting that you tried to you tried to see a future with someone, but you just don't see it. Okay, you you gave a you gave someone a try for like three to four months and I'm getting like it's just like nah, it's not working for you. The chemistry's just not there. Okay. You guys just don't mix well. Yeah, so you're going to leave them. I feel like you're going to leave them in, in like a couple of days. I feel like you spend all day thinking about uh, you and this person and how you how y'all's chemistry go like mixes well. I feel like it doesn't. Okay, Virgo. I feel like someone, especially if this is from my air sign, I feel like the air sign is too harsh to you, too harsh on you, too serious. Okay, you're looking for someone that's a little bit more tempered, a little bit more sweet, a little bit more kind. Okay, I feel like I feel like you're looking for a Sagittarius, not an air sign. For those of you that don't know air signs, a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius, you're looking for someone with a little bit more passion, like a, a like a um, fire sign. Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries. I feel like I feel like air for you, Virgo, is too detached. It leaves you thinking. It leaves you wondering. This could be, I'm not going to lie, a fire sign could feel like that by you. You always leave them, like, alone. You're, you're, you're detached. You're always spending time by yourself, like, or you're always at work or something like that. You're never at home. They're looking for more love and affection, more passion, more time, more chemistry. Especially if you want to make this last. I mean, make it last forever and ever. For sure. I mean, especially if this is a Sagittarius, they're flighty. It takes nothing for them to leave, especially if they feel lonely. They will move on quick. You have no idea. Sagittarius rules leaps and fucking uh, love, and they will leap their ass into the next relationship, especially if they feel like that you're not getting enough love and affection from you. 
Yeah, two of pentacles. I feel like someone here is weighing their fucking options, whether they're going to stick around, especially if they're feeling alone. Can I get a card, please, for Virgo at the top? Can I get a card, please, for Virgo at the top? I feel like I feel like um, someone is trying to use their patience here, but if, if, if something doesn't change fast, okay, like someone's definitely going to be out. Two of Cups. So I'm getting um, King of Pentacles. Someone likes to uh, have slow, passionate sex. Could be an earth sign. Okay, I'm getting that you guys probably are going to make love tonight. Others of you, someone's going to make a, a decision in regards to their relationship. I'm getting that someone here is... No longer waiting around for your love. They're going to move on, especially if it's a fire sign. I feel like someone's love here is money, work. I feel like someone here is really emotionally imbalanced right now. And someone is choosing to just move the fuck on. I feel like also, Virgo, maybe you should take your time in this relationship, okay? Because you could be, if this is not you, this 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 fire sign could be rushing you um, in this relationship. Um, I, I feel like I feel like this fire sign needs to slow the fuck down because I feel like there's a lot of things that you guys need to talk out about. Something here is not a a, a big mesh of uh, greatness, or it, something's not mixing well, is what I'm trying to say. Excuse me. I'm actually, I'm actually getting, um, someone could be taking, um, a relationship with a friend to the next level. So no longer friends anymore. And I'm getting you guys cross the line. You guys had sex. You guys could have had sex like three days ago, two days ago. Okay. Maybe you feel, um, scared cause you don't want to mess up the friendship connection. That's where you feel most secure at, as a friend. You don't want to hurt this person. You feel like you feel like you could possibly hurt them, so you want to take your time and make sure you don't sever the friend connection. Moving on. I heard. <laughs> I like that. I, I heard life is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're gonna get until you open it. Oh my god. I'm getting that maybe you just have to take a chance. Especially if this person's a friend. Maybe you guys can be real lovers. Sometimes people bring... Sometimes God put people in your in your life for the strangest reasons. To help ground you. Help you build. Maybe, maybe God just doesn't simply want you to be alone. Moving on. I want to move on. Can I get a card, please, for the two of uh, two of chalice? Why is the two of chalice here, please, for uh, Virgo? What's happening here? I, I heard Gemini is not sure if they if they love you. Okay, I'm also hearing that um, a water sign is not sure if they're going to. Uh, I, I feel like a water sign is very 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 confused right now. If you guys are dealing with water signs, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, they're not sure. They're not sure. They could a, a water sign could possibly feel like you're taking advantage of them, okay? Or this is how you feel like a water sign is taking advantage for, of you for you for your money, okay? Yeah, I feel like you have a lot to offer, Virgo, and you feel like this person is taking advantage of you, okay? And that possibly hurts your feelings, okay? Yeah. So the two of pen, the two of chalice is clarified by the nine of swords. A lot of worry, a lot of stress, okay? It's like it's like it's like um. Yeah, no future, future breakup. You don't want to break up the friendship that you have with someone. You love them that much. This is what you're worried about. You guys could be connecting with an air sign, water sign, or fire sign. But I, I'm getting, I'm getting that. 
your friendship with this person means more than a sexual relationship. And that's what you're worried about. Others of you, I feel like if you're in a relationship, y'all are going to break up. There is no future here. Okay, after you guys break up with this person, I'm getting that God's going to send you somebody to help you heal yourself. Okay? I'm getting God's going to send you someone so you can stop crying, stop stressing, stop worrying, stop obsessing about your future and being alone. You're not going to be alone. There's barely any sex in this in this reading, so I'm going to try to pull out sex cards. Can I get a sex card, please, for the temperance? Why is the temperance here, please, for Virgo? Why is the temperance here, please, for Virgo? Why is the temperance here, please, for Virgo? It says the sex is just okay. So someone is a, 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 a slow, smooth operator. I'm hearing that song. Smooth operator. It's just... The sex is just okay. I'm getting someone here as a slow, sensual, sexual lover. Okay. I'm getting I'm getting to you. Sex is not a big deal. I just did a reading for somebody. This could have been uh, your other reading that I was saying that Virgo, like, sex is not everything to to a to a Virgo. Like they can go with or without it. And when, but when they go with it, dog, it's a it's a whole fucking shebang. It's a movie when you get fucked by a fucking Virgo. Okay. Maybe maybe you thought that someone had a high sex drive, Virgo. Maybe you thought this fire sign was going to be the shiznick, okay? But I'm getting it was just okay. It was mediocre. It wasn't nothing to be all <laughs> hyped up about. It was all right, okay? I'm actually getting that someone is coming in town today. You guys are going to have sex. Meh. Moving on. Can I get a card, please, for the Two of Cups? It says big dick but useless. Okay, so the sex is just okay, big dick but useless. Okay, well how else do you how else do you explain that? That's pretty self-explanatory. I'm getting that there's a little bit of embarrassment here though from an ear sign. I'm getting I'm getting that <laughs> I'm getting that um an ear sign things could have been getting real hot and heavy and like their dick lost the gumption or someone got dry really fast. I feel like um Someone here is a little embarrassed with this Nine of Swords. But someone here really can't put the mat down, though. I'm getting it was just okay. You know how when guys get too excited, they have a hard time coming or they have a hard time staying up? I feel like it's one of those situations. Like, someone here is so excited that, like, <laughs> they kind of, like, um, psych out themselves. Big energy on water and air, Okay. Can I get a card, please, for the uh, Three of Wands? Why is the Three of Wands here? It says, drunk high sex turns me on. Okay. Someone's here again. Intoxicated. Can I get a card, please, for the Nine of uh, Swords, please, for Virgo? So I, I definitely feel like someone here, this, this uh, Sagittarius gets really fucked up. I'm getting so fucked up to the point where they can't even really, yeah, you know I mean, fuck. They, they, they about to pass out. I feel like the room is spinning for someone. And you're like kissing on them. Oh, this could be you, Virgo. The room is spinning for you. You're intoxicated. Okay, you could be a man that you're, I'm getting that you're, you can't even keep it up really because you're so fucked up. Moving on. Can I get a card, please? For the uh, Nine of Swords. Why is the Nine of Swords here? I love toys. Okay, so maybe someone is worried that you don't that you may not like toys or that may not turn you on. Or maybe someone's worried that they have to use they have to use a toy because again, they're having a hard time with the dick energy. Maybe this is a guy and a guy has to use a fucking toy because you're dry as fuck. It says spit on it. I knew it. Someone here is dry. 
okay? I'm getting someone here likes it when it's real, real, real wet. It could be definitely an air sign or an earth sign, but that's what I got for you. Bye.